The weather couldn't be much worse when Tottenham Hotspurs kick off at York against the local lads. Naturally, the odds are on a victory for Spurs, for York City hail from the third division north. Spurs are quickly away with some typical close passing work. Duke in tumbles and the ground's mighty hard. Spurs move towards the York goal. A good move that culminates in a pass to unmarked George Robb. A side foot shot and Spurs have scored in the first ten minutes. York City, quite undaunted by the setback, move out for revenge with some neat, cool teamwork. Bill Fenton leads the attack. Then teammate Bill Hughes takes over. A centre to Wilkinson, and there's the equaliser. A superb header by Wilkinson. York with Wilkinson again in action, come back for another. Fenton has two shots at goal, and the second smacks home. York, the little team with a big heart, have taken the lead. Half-time and the score's the same. A quick warm-up and York are off again. They're putting up a magnificent display, as skillful and confident as they come. Bill Fenton has it again. On he goes to centre to Wilkinson. A terrific slam and York City have clinched the match. 3-1 is the final score, the biggest surprise of round five. York, giant killers back in 1938, joined the last eight teams in their bid for the cup.